What's up, everybody? It's your boy Two Phones for Free back again with another informative information. Um, I, I've been saying this in my comment section a lot uh, when it, in, in terms of when it comes to text now and uh, what phones are compatible and how to activate and things and that sort. If you guys just go to help.textnow.com um, article or link, I'll put the link in the description box and in my comment section. So you have two ways to find this, and you guys just have to read and click on the link. I'm not clickbait, so there's no need to skip over the link and think you're going to get a virus or anything, or I'm going to get paid for it. This is a, not a paid video. All right? This is the most asked question in my text now videos on the comment section. Go to them now. You can go to all the text now videos I've made. Everyone asks the same question all the time. What? How can I activate text now for free or what phones are compatible with text now for free? So here we are. We're at the main source. We're at the main link text now's website. OK, activation kit frequently asked. They have tons of them. what do GSM and CDA mean? This is what a lot of you all need to pay attention to. What devices can I use, which I just brought up? Uh, can I use a tablet with text now? How do I unlock my device? Do I need Wi-Fi? And these are all the questions, majority of them, that you guys ask me every day on those videos on my YouTube channel. And I, I can't get I can't get to them uh, every single last one. I have a ton, thousands of videos, okay? And I get hundreds of comments. So it, it's hard to get to all of them. So I hope this video helps you guys out. So let, let's just get to the bottom line right now. What does GSM and CDA mean? We're going to break this down. GSM and CDA, CDMA are types of wireless networks. The GSM stands for Global System for Mobile Communications, while CDMA stands for Code Division Multiple Access. GSM is used worldwide, while CDMA is used primarily within the U.S. T-Mobile and AT&T run GSM networks, with Sprint and Verizon using CDMA networks. So I, I, I hope that explains the difference between the two. Now, let's let's break down the devices. What devices can I use to activate? TextNow can use unlocked CDMA Android and iOS smartphones and tablets. For Android devices, we support devices on Marshmallow 6 and above, and or above, and for iOS, we support iOS 12 and or above. Wow. Wow. That's wow. That's um that's mind blowing. So if you got an Android 6.0 device, Text Now services will still work on an Android 6. Wow. I see that's why a lot of people being cheap. <laughs> Anyways, to find out if your particular device is compatible, head on over to our Get Started page. And I'm going to just go straight to the TextNow website and show you um, some, you know, examples of phones that are compatible. And that's all you guys got to um, run by. Can I use a tablet? If the tablet is CDMA compatible, we should be able to use it. Uh, with one of our SIM cards. For Android devices, the tablet should be Marshmallow 6 and all, and of course, I was 12 and them. How do I unlock my device? In order to use TextNow with your G GSM or CDMA, your device will need to be unlocked. Each carrier will have a slightly different method of unlocking your device. And I got two videos showing you my Nokia 3.1A from AT&T it's unlocked and it runs on the T-Mobile SIM, the GSM SIM from TextNow. Same thing with my A51 5G. I got two videos about that. All you guys got to do is watch the videos and I explain how to unlock them. All right, but contact your carrier for more help on how to unlock your specific device. Now, those come with AT&T um, device unlock applications. Now, if you guys want me to do a specific video about that, I'll do a separate video about how to unlock your AT&T phones to work on TextNow's GSM SIM card. Now, that I can help you with. Okay, so it says the FCC also has helpful, uh, frequently asked questions regarding to unlock devices. 
So you guys, I will put that link in the description box as well for the LCC uh, frequently asked questions about unlocking devices. Now, do I need Wi-Fi to use for my activation kit? Yes, you will need Wi-Fi because your service is not activated and it won't have any internet connection or data or any type of connection until you get on Wi-Fi. That's the same way with Sprint, same way with T-Mobile, with Verizon, whoever you activate with. Okay, do I need to buy an activation kit in order to use my own device? Uh, like they say, it depends on your device. Certain specific CDMA phones from Sprint, Boost, and Virgin Mobile, we can activate directly onto TextNow without the need of another SIM card. For all other unlocked phones or GSM phones, we'll ship you an activation kit with the right SIM card to use with text now so if your government assisted phone runs on the sprint network with a sprint sim or you got a boost mobile sprint phone or you got a virgin mobile sprint phone and it's deactivated i believe that's what it is deactivated they can wow okay here we go man oh snap okay now you learn something new every day can I pull my text down SIM card and use it with another device? If you have another device that is compatible with the type of SIM card you have from TextNow, it's a uh, and it's a phone that we can activate on TextNow, we'll be able to swap service to the new phone for you. Contact the TextNow support. Now, here's the thing. If you're using the Sprint, yeah, you have to call in. But if you got the new SIM card, the GSM is already activated. The SIM card is. And all you have to do is pop it into another phone and put the APN settings in, which I got a video about that. You will get service. And just download the text now app for calls and text. Or if you just want to use, um, like, like for a tablet, you just want to use Google search and all the free apps and the downloaded stuff going to work regardless. So, Keep that in mind. Okay. Also, the website is asking me for my MEID number. Where can I find it? Depending on the device you're using, the MEID number might be listed as the ESN or the IMEI. Generally, the MEID number will be a 14-digit string and may contain both letters and numbers. You guys got to go through your Android device system settings and your iOS, iOS system settings. All right. Just the, hey, just go to the website. Okay. So that I hope this video was very informative for the people on text now. They keep asking the same question when they come to my videos. Uh, my how to how to activate or does the GSM work? Does the Sprint work? Go to the text now frequently asked questions link. And here it is right here. Does Sprint work? Okay. So it says, is Sprint using net, uh, is text now using Sprint network? You may have heard that Sprint was recently acquired by another national U.S. carrier. Currently, there has been no change to the wireless service. Text now free nationwide talking text plan is still powered by the nationwide Sprint network. In 2021, our free cellular phone service will be moving to a faster LTE network that offers wider coverage across the United States and is compatible with more devices. What does that mean for you? Do nothing. There is currently no change in the service for you. New customers, if you're interested in signing up for the free national, nationwide uh, talk and text service, check your current device. All on the website again so i hope i <laughs> answered all your questions or they can finish answering them on the website let me know your thoughts in the comment section below did you know 